Just hours after defeat, the Conservative Party is promising a review to figure out what went so wrong. There are plenty of suggestions. We could have used the front bench a little bit more, um, and uh, I think that would have uh, demonstrated to people that the Prime Minister had a, uh, a, a very strong uh, cabinet and, and strong caucus. Oh, I think the problem was the NDP, that the NDP, uh, they, they failed and uh, the, the, the Liberals uh, took their votes. But Stephen Harper is putting the blame in just one place. The disappointment you also feel is my responsibility and mine alone. Harper has asked the party to find an interim leader and start a leadership race. But know this for certain, when the next time comes, this party will offer Canadians a strong and clear alternative based on our conservative values. As he walks away from the party, he does it knowing he defined those conservative values. Whatever happens next will inevitably be a shift, with numerous opinions about just what change should mean for this party. The conservative message, which is basically one of uh, a strong economy, low taxes, uh, balanced budgets, uh, good things for homeowners and working people, all of those messages are positive messages, but they've got to be delivered with warmth and they've got to be delivered in a positive way. The way that message is delivered will, of course, depend on the new leader, and whoever it is will have to be committed with a four-year wait before the next shot at forming government. Catherine Cullen, CBC News, Ottawa.